The objective of a roll tack is to steer the boat using crew weight as opposed to the rudder. The less rudder used, the more speed is carried through the manoeuvre, which is why a roll tack is the fastest way to tack. The first step is to prepare for the tack. This means cleaning up the sheets in the boat so that they won't get tangled, taking the slack out of the new jib sheet, checking for boats around you and warning your crew. Make sure to have good speed going into the tack. From the outside, there should be no indication that you are about to tack, so don't initiate a leeward heel by leaning in or standing up, as this just slows you down. Allow the boat to come up into the wind naturally. Don't push the tiller over, let it naturally move over to the leeward side. Notice how the skipper doesn't push the tiller all the way over. The boat is automatically steering itself into the wind. As the boat nears head to wind, the skipper and crew stay sitting on the gunwale. The skipper keeps the main sheet on tight and the jib is still fully sheeted. As the old windward gunwale is about to go underwater and the jib is about to be completely backwinded, the skipper and the crew move in together. This is also when the crew starts to sheet on the jib to the new side. At this point, the boat is already 90% through the tack and pointing in the new direction, so the skipper starts to straighten the tiller. Once the boat completes the final 10% of its direction change, the tiller is in the centre of the boat and the skipper has firmly put the tiller extension on the new gunwale. This is very important because it locks the tiller in place as the skipper moves through the boat. Notice how the main sheet is still tight and both sailors are moving across the boat at the same time. Once the skipper and crew are sitting on the new gunwale, make sure to keep the weight forward. Notice how the crew does a great job in changing the jib sheet so that the sail barely flaps at all. The crew should have the new jib sheet in hand as they move across the boat. This will automatically pull the sheet almost all the way on. The crew can either reach forward as they move across the boat and cleat the new jib in front of them, or pull the sheet across the boat with them before turning around to sit on the gunwale and then cleating the jib. Both methods work well, so whichever suits you best and enables you to get the sheet all the way on whilst you move smoothly across the boat is the one you should go with. Overall, it is important to remember that slow is smooth and smooth is fast. Don't steer too much or force the tiller over. Roll the boat all the way to windward until the gunwale touches the water, then move through the boat together. Keep the main sheet tight and snap the jib all the way in before it can flap.